Royal Baby Reveal, How Prince William Reacted With Shock To A Royal Baby Photo Call Meghan Markle and Prince Harry introduced their newborn Archie Harrison Windsor Mountbatten during a photo call at Windsor Castle, and while we do not know how the couple really felt about showing off their tot in front of the cameras, a newly resurfaced report reveals what was going through Prince William's mind while he posed on the steps at the Lindo Wing of St. May's Hospital with Kate Middleton and baby Prince George. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex opted for an intimate way to introduce their royal baby to the public. Meghan gave birth on Monday morning, and unlike Prince William and Kate Middleton, who stepped out with their three newborns hours after birth, they waited two days for the big reveal. The couple stood beaming while answering a few questions about parenting at St. George's Hall, Windsor Castle, on Wednesday. Speaking as her husband held the tot, Meghan said, It's magic. It's pretty amazing. I have the two best guys in the world. Even though the two seemed excited about sharing the news, it is not clear how they really felt about showing off their baby. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex had previously expressed their desire to keep details surrounding the birth private unlike Prince William and Kate Middleton. In a newly resurfaced CNN interview, Prince William revealed how he felt the moment he and Kate appeared appeared on the steps at the Lindo Wing of St. Mary's Hospital in London to show baby George for the first time. In 2013, Prince William said, I think more shock was the feeling I felt, but I was on such a high anyway, and so was Catherine, about George that really we were happy to show him off to whoever wanted to see him. As any new parent knows, you are only too happy to show off your new child and, you know, proclaim that he is the best looking or the best everything. It's nice that people want to see George. I'm just glad he wasn't screaming his head off the whole way through. The prince also admitted that when he deftly secured his son's car seat in the back of his vehicle on the first try, there was more than luck involved in the perfectly executed maneuver. He said, Believe me it wasn't my first time. I know there's been some speculation about that. I had to practice, I really did. I was terrified it was going to fall off or the door wasn't going to close properly. When asked if the decision of driving his young family home was to reinforce perceptions that he will bring a more modern approach to Britain's monarchy, the heir to the throne told CNN it was simply more about doing things his way. Having jovial responses to royal births seems to be a popular trait in the royal family. According to 2013 Netflix documentary The Royals, Philip casually met his newborn son, Prince Charles, commenting that he looked like a plum pudding. In 1992 biography Diana, Her True Story, which was written in collaboration with the princess, author Andrew Morton claimed the first words Charles said about Prince Harry were, Oh God, it's a boy. And he's even got red hair. Royal correspondent Camilla Tomini also claimed the Queen made a crew joke when she met baby Prince William for the first time. The Queen reportedly said about her grandson, Thank goodness he hasn't ears like his father.